Samantha and welcome to day five of the Buying Your Bibliothon. Today's challenge is being hosted by Katrina from The Little Book Owl and today's challenge is the Fictitious Food Network. I don't know if you know this about me but I used to love the Food Network when I was a kid. Like I would watch it every day when I got home from school. I absolutely loved the Food Network and I love cooking so I'm really excited about this one. I hope you enjoy it and here's the video. Hello there, it's Hermione. So I was recently reading in the library, Dreams and Light Reading, and I saw that apparently the best diet for humans is a vegan diet. And I realized that a lot of the foods that they serve us in this wizarding world do not cater towards a vegan diet. So I've decided to try and make my own vegan butter beer so that more witches and wizards can become vegan too. So our first step in making our vegan butter beer is to measure out six ounces of apple juice. Now we just want to pour this into a pan and heat it for five minutes. And we're supposed to stir it constantly as we do it. You don't want to bring it to the boil. <sighs> now, using muggle appliances can be really boring and take a really long time. So instead of waiting five minutes, I'm just gonna use my magic. So now it's time to add the cinnamon and ginger. Two dashes of cinnamon. And one pinch of ginger. And at this stage, we need to add one teaspoon of imitation butter. So while that's all combining, it's time to measure out two ounces of, of non-dairy milk or creamer. I'm using soy milk. Now it's time to pour this over, pour the apple mixture over the soy milk. Pop it off with a pinch of cinnamon. And there you have it, vegan butter beer that's just as good as the stuff that you get in three broomsticks. Anyway, that is going to be all for today's video. I hope you liked it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe down below. If you took part in today's challenge, please link your video down below so I can go and check it out and get inspired for more recipes. Because I, as I said, I love to cook, although I am vegan, so I won't be able to make a lot of the things other people make, but I can try. And that's going to be all for today's video, and I'll see you tomorrow with day six. Bye.